asthma is a chronic inflammatory disorder of the airways included within the obstructive lung diseases. Here, you are able to view the cross section of the ovary. The ovary is covered by the tunica albuginea and is divided into the outer cortex and the inner medulla. The cortex appears more dense and granular due to the presence of numerous ovarian follicles in various stages of development. You are able to see few maturing follicles. The graphene follicle is a mature ovarian follicle. The characteristic feature of a graphene follicle is a central atrium surrounded by three covering layers. The outer theca layer further divided into theca externa and the theca interna which secretes the estrogen, granulosa cell layer. The graphene follicle has secondary oocyte which is located eccentrally and is surrounded by a non-cellular layer of zona pellucida by the vitellin membrane of the oocyte. Here you see the graphene follicle rupture to form the oocyte. After ovulation and in response to luteinizing hormone, the remnant of ruptured graphene follicle enlarges and is transformed into a corpus luteum. The corpus luteum is a glandular structure that secretes progesterone and some estrogen. Its fate depends on whether the fertilization occurs. If fertilization does not take place, the corpus luteum remains functional for about 10 days. Then it begins to degenerate into a corpus albicans, which is primarily scar tissue and its hormone output ceases.